What's up, it's Bass Cartel, Mystery Tackle, Box Unboxing, so let's get right into this. Sit to, to the side and grab this card, About Your Box, Mystery Tackle Box Pro Experience. First off, we're starting off with the Thread Fin Shad Bait Ball Crankbait Magnum, made by Live Target, and said this is new, which is selling for $16.99, ideal for clear water. An oversized lure has a tight wobble and uses several flash points on the body to drive bass wild. So let's jump right into this, get down a little gritty. All right, you guys, this is a 2.75 inch, dies 12, in, 12 feet. I'm sorry, it's a 5 eighths of an ounce. Color is a metallic pearl olive shad. The rattles in there. Pretty good, deep diver. Okay, one thing I did notice about this live target, if you're out there listening, Tackle Warehouse, whoever this thing came from, these hooks are rusty. I don't know how it's supposed to be new. You're saying new, so it's supposed to be a brand new lure and brand new manufacturer. And I have rusty hooks. How is that possible? I don't know, but we're moving on to the next lure. This sells for $16.99 if I didn't mention it already. So next is this a bill action first pivot frog, which sells for $6.99. So Bill's gravity hook system optimizes snag free frog fishing, increases hookup ratio on the realistic hollow body frog. And this is 2.5 inches color PF AF. Hey, so Bill, you out there listening, man? What the heck color is that? I mean, why? What is so hard about saying green back, white belly? You know what? What is? What is that like? Hey man, I caught a frog, man. Do you want it? Yeah, what color is it? Oh, it's PFF2. Like, what what is that? Like, you know, that's not, that's not a color, man. We we're, we're not mixing paints over here, okay? Like, you know, if you guys out there listening, man, you know, put put, put the color on there, you know. It got to be mentioned, like, you know, got to be mentioned, but it's supposed to be a hollow body frog, which is hook system is pretty different. Doesn't have your two standard hooks that's on the side. <clears throat> and pretty much when you throw this out in the water, the weight that's on the hook brings the hook down while your body floats up. But I will say this. This is a con, 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 con. No pro to this at all. This hook right here is not flush with the body. You see that? So this is a manage to go under something. It will get hooked. This is not flush. They saying that it's weird. It is not flush at all. Maybe because, I don't know, this. I know my hook is not centered. It's not centered with the frog. It tends to want to go to the, to the right side of the frog. But I don't know. Moving on. We have up next is the all-terrain tackle <coughs> football jig. All-terrain tackle football jig sells for $4.29. You can trust this football head jig to drag through rocks and over hard bottom areas throughout without getting hung up. So $4.29. And this color right here is not listed, but this is a 3 8 of an ounce. It is not listed, but I went on the website to find out what color this is and pronounce. Excuse my pronunciation. Moynax Magic. The word is spelled M-O-Y-N-A-G-S. Apostrophe S. Moynax Football Jig. And this is the color. Moynax. So, I don't know. Moynax, what is that? Why well, I just look at this as being green pumpkin purple, green pumpkin jelly, whatever you want to call it. But I needed one of these. I appreciate this coming in my Lucky Tackle box. On to the next. We have the Reigns Bubble Shaker. And this is a Japanese company. Uh, you get a... Eight pack for five ninety nine, and these are four inch green pumpkin, salt and freshwater fishing gear for novice and professional anglers. Ideal bait for drop shotting with a large red body. The extra added texture makes sure the bass hold on for extra strikes. Me personally, I'm not going to be drop shot. I'm not on the boat. I'm not on the dock. I bank fish, so I will be doing shaky head. And get one of these open. Get this open so I can show you guys. Has a nice amount of stretch, ribbed all the way around. Does have a smell to it. Smells familiar, I just can't put my finger on it. Doesn't stink, doesn't stink at all. But I just can't put my finger on that smell. Okay. Next up we have the Savage Gear Armor 2 one. This is one of my favorite, 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 favorite lore companies. And this is a five and a half inch, one third of an ounce salt and pepper. The nylon mesh cord construction means it will not fly off your hook. You can wacky rig this worm all day. It's eight pack. 
3D armor scan. And I don't know if you guys can see it, but like this top two, they're black. The next two are gray. Then it's black, gray, black. And it has like black and silver flakes in it. But let me get one of these out. They don't have no smelts. So I'm already smelt these. Crap. Let me grab a gray one too. All right. Here's a gray one. Some stretch. Now, right here, there's some material in there. That I'm pretty sure they're talking about the mesh. And, of course, your wacky rig. And they're saying that it's not supposed to rip out through that. But I use the O-rings, and this is the black one. No sense on them at all. Like as far as Savage gear, I have three of their swim baits, actually four swim baits. I have three glides, I believe one in the five inch and the other in the six inch. Maybe five and a half, six and a half, I'm not, not too sure. And I have the six or eight inch trout, live trout, like that's, that thing is like an actual fish in your hand. And now I have these. And moving on to the next, we have Mona Hooks <coughs> and Ray Shaky Head 3-pack. This is quarter ounce 5-hour hook, 439. The head is green pumpkin. I will be using these. I'll pair it up with this. I have a couple other Shaky Heads, but I can pair it up with that. And didn't win anything. If I did win, it would have been a dodge or tool of bait casting reel. Of course, you got your mystery tackle by sticker, and you got your double digest. This right here just pretty much tells you, you know, how to fish your lures and what type of fishing you should be doing around the time. And I'm wondering if they sent me the right book because this is talking about catfish. I don't know. This is kind of weird to me. It's talking about catfish when it should be just talking about bass. I don't know. Who knows? Not going to get into it. Uh, One thing. Let's see. Like I said, this mystery tackle box, this box cost me $25 a month. And this box, the amount of lures that came in, six different lures. Or tackle, whatever you want to call it. Terminal tackle, fishing lures, hooks, whatever. This box actually comes out to just over $43. So $25 a month and I got $43 worth of lures. So I'm going to wrap this up. Thanks for watching and please like, comment, and subscribe to this video. Because there are plenty more videos ahead that are coming.